What's up, guys? My name's Kenny. Hope you're all feeling good today. It is Sunday, April 14th. We're going to play Wordle Connections, the mini crossword, and strands in this video. Let's go ahead and get started with Wordle. Today, the randomizer gave me the word decry as my starting guess. So I'm going to put that in and see what I get from it. I get not a single letter. Okay, what about float? Float gets me an L, a green L, second position, and that is also it. Okay. How about blink? Is blink correct? Well, there's B-L-I. Okay. Bliss. No. Swing and a miss. Okay. Uh, blink seemed like a pretty good guess for guess three. Um, but bliss was a miss. So, blimp. Um, blimp. Let's do blimp. Yep. Okay. I had to look and see if there was like any other options because I wanted, I only had two guesses left. So I wanted to just make sure real quick and okay. Yeah. Blimp. There we go. That, uh, that was a little bit unfortunate that blink and bliss were, uh, were need were not correct. Uh, so I guess there was definitely a few BLI words there, and I uh, took a few guesses to, to get the correct answer there. But um, All right, well, there you go. There's Wordle. Leave a comment. Let me know how you guys did on Wordle today. Now we can move on to everybody's favorite game, Connections. Just give me a moment real quick to open that up. We will solve today's Connections. Here we go. Connections, April 14th. Let's see what we got. Okay, we have Wedding Spirit Drill Fryer, American Sundry. Not sure what Sundry is. Yank? Like, okay. Um, monkey Wrench. Routine Practice Drill. And exercise, those go together, I think. A bit of repetitive training, okay. You have rip and tear. I'm not sure if there's another one there. Um, I can't remember what fryer is. I should know that word for sure. Oh, uh, United and American. These are airlines. And then is Frontier one? Oh, and Spirit. Yeah. These are airlines, I think. I hope this is all of them. I hope these are all correct. Yet yeah, they are. U.S. based airlines. It's the blue category. Uh, okay. So we got the yellow and the purple, the hard one and the easy one. I feel like rip and tear should go together. Uh, maybe it's yank and wrench, but yank and wrench don't mean rip and tear, I don't think. I think because I don't remember what a fryer is, and I don't even know if I've ever heard of what a sundry is, I think that's going to make this kind of difficult. Like, those could be easy words, part of the easy category, and I'm just completely... You know, uh, unaware of, of those meanings. Um, I can't remember. See, Friar, I can't remember. I, I'm going to sound stupid for even trying to guess what this word means because, like, I, I can't remember if it's a person or if it's a event or a thing. Like, I can't remember. But, like, once you tell me, like, I'll be like, okay, I, I think I know what it is, but... I see that word all the time, and I just never really care to figure out what it is, I think. So, yeah, that's a little disappointing. Wrench. Monkey. Well, monkey, 
I don't think. Well, could monkey be like um, the verb, I guess, to monkey around or something? But I was gonna say there's no like synonyms for monkey on here, so that's probably the purple category. I, I guess rip, tear, yank, and wrench, but I don't really know if that makes any sense. Just like, I, I don't know. Let, let's see if that's right. It is? Pull using force? I wasn't thinking about... Okay, so I was thinking about motions. But, like, I thought that yank and wrench were just so different of motions than rip and tear. But I guess they are pulling motions, and I didn't quite get that. Hmm. Okay. That... that For being an easy category, I definitely... I, I'm not sure about that one. Or I just overthought it. I mean, that's possibly the case. I mean, like, my initial instinct was that they went together, so I guess I kind of knew what they were going for there, but I couldn't quite make the, like, precise connection, I guess, so I was hesitant on that one. Definitely didn't want to put in a guess for it, but mine as well when we're down to this point. Okay, and then final category, monkey, sundry, wedding, and fryer, because I don't really know what sundry or fryer is. Um... Might as well not even try to guess this one. What is it? Beginning with day abbreviations. Wow. So Friar, like Friday, Monday, monkey, Sunday, sundry, Wednesday, wedding. That one is... Okay, they've done stuff like that before, but this one just seems like the most insane, difficult one that they've done with those. <laughs> that is crazy. Like, it, it, those are like the most difficult ones in this game because now you, like, if you really have to do, like, okay, I guess the way to solve that one is to... Look at those words and realize they have nothing in common with each other. So then you have to start looking at the the word structure and the spellings. But it, this game was going to be really difficult if you have to do that all the time. I'm glad they don't do it all the time. Because if they started doing it all the time, I would have to go around and like in all of these words, I'm going to have to go like, okay, D-R-I, okay, E-X-E, okay, P-R-A, you know, and like... Or like, I have to start looking at the end of words. Okay, united. Oh, I, I better not be giving them any ideas here, but... Oh, united. It ends in a name. Ted. Connections. Do not be watching this video and take this idea from me. I will be very mad. Do not just choose a bunch of words that end in, like, three-letter names of... First names of people, like Ted. <laughs> or American. It ends in can. Like, if they start doing that, like, this game is going to, like, get so much more difficult. And, and like, this one, I like, ah, oh, man, I I was not getting this one today. Okay, okay, yeah. I, I'm <laughs> uh, Let me know how you guys feel about that category, if you were able to get it. Uh, while you think about that, I'm going to look up what the heck Sundry is. And I know what Fryer is. I'm just going to look it up, and I'm going to be mad at myself for not remembering. Uh, sundry... I'm assuming it's sundry, not sundry. Of various kinds, several. Um. Hmm. Okay, I didn't know that. And then, prior. A member of certain religious orders of men. Okay, that's what I thought it was, but yeah, you know, it's like, well, okay, it is exactly what I thought it was. I didn't say that that's what I thought it was, but I thought it was that. And uh, I just wasn't sure. I couldn't remember. Um, so yeah, I didn't know what Fryer was. I just, I don't know. Too uncertain, I guess. Okay. Um, 
Yeah, I just, I can't believe that yellow category with Yank and Wrench, I just, I didn't think that they were the same thing as Rip and Tear, because Rip and Tear are like identical almost, and Wrench and Yank aren't identical to those, so it, it it's, yeah, man. All right, well, there we go. Uh, let me know how you guys did on this one. Let's go ahead and move on now to the mini crossword here. Give me a moment real quick. Okay, here we go. Mini crossword, Sunday, April 14th. Let's see if I can solve it today. One across, ensnare, uh, maybe trap, uh, blank millions, lottery. Uh, I'm, uh, is this mega? Mega, mega millions? One down, you spare me. Oh, TMI, too much information. Okay, six across. Gets the wrinkles out of irons? Maybe. Edit menu option after a whoops. A whoops. Undo. They seem to use undo or redo a lot in the crosswords, and I always, whenever the, whenever the correct answer is redo, I always put undo. Hold on. So this one's probably undo, and this one looks like rerun. Is it rerun? Yeah, okay, it is. Any episode of Seinfeld or Friends. Um, nine across, 2023 biopic. I don't know exactly what biopic is, for which Annette Benning, no, no idea who that is, and Jodie Foster. I probably do know who it is, but once again, I can't connect names to faces of people. Uh, Jodie Foster, again, a name I know, but the face, uh, I, I can't, I don't know who Jodie Foster is uh, by connecting the face to the name, but you show me a picture of Jodie Foster, I'm going to be like, oh yeah, I know who that is. I read Jodie Foster, I'm like, yes, I know that name. But again, person's face, person's name, they're in two different parts of my brain, and I, I don't, yeah. Unless it's like somebody, yeah, there's certain people that I know, certain people I don't know, and it's really just a, a coin toss, uh, whether I... I, I <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually familiar with them or not. What is this? A G O N. Extreme. Oh, agony. Right. Extreme suffering. Panda. Animal that eats, shoots, and leaves. Oh. <laughs> eats, shoots, and leaves. <laughs> That's a funny way of saying that. It, it makes you think that they, they're like shooting. They eat, they shoot, and they leave. Um, unless that is what they mean. I don't think so. I'm assuming they mean they eat shoots and they eat leaves. Grass in a landscaper's roll. Uh... Hmm. I don't understand what this one is. Uh, seven and nine across, I don't know. So, I, I don't really want to take the time to try to think about what they are. Let, so, let's just see what the answer is. Uh, sod. Okay, I didn't know that. And then Naya, I did not know that one either. Okay. Yeah, that, those, that one was just like the worst case scenario for me. Because I didn't know either seven down or nine across. Everything else, though, I got, so that's pretty good. All right, so there is the mini for today. Let's go ahead and uh, and move on to strands now and see if I can uh, do that one today. All right, here we go, strands. Of course, it is always better in strands when I uh, don't have to use a hint, um, but we'll see what happens today. Join the club. Uh... Hmm. Join the club. Not sure. Oh, I bet you it's sandwiches, because I see sand. Sandwich? Okay. Uh, mayonnaise. How do you spell mayonnaise? Tom 
Okay, tomato. There's two TOs in tomato, so I started from the wrong end then that one. Uh turkey. Uh lettuce? Are these just these are just um oh is this these are all ingredients for specifically like a club sandwich? Is that what it is? Because I thought it was going to be types of sandwiches, but obviously with mayonnaise, that doesn't make sense. Like, who's just eating a mayonnaise sandwich? Like, only mayonnaise. Nothing else. Pickle. Bacon. Wow. Oh, not not back? No. Bacon. All right. Super easy one today. Wow. That was unexpected for it to be that easy. Okay. No struggles there. Uh, I'm, I'm assuming everybody's going to have a really great time on strands today. So congratulations. We get an easy one today. Hopefully you guys didn't struggle with that one. Uh, they're, they, they're not going to get any easier than that, I don't think. Um, so, hey, when they're easy, I can do it. You know, when they're things I don't know, when they're difficult words for me, things I've never heard of, things I'm not familiar with. Yeah, it's, it's going to be, it's going to take me, you know, 10 minutes to do it, but not today. Uh, there we go. All right, guys. Appreciate you guys watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like. Uh, check out my chess channel. I'm uploading a chess game every single day over there. Link is in the description. Um, and that's it. Hope you guys have a good one. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care.